Hello and welcome to my attempt at the step door puzzle for today. The idea is to guess a four, five, six and seven letter word, but with only 20 total guesses. You do them one after the other. They don't have to be connected words, but I always like to guess connected words as my starting point because otherwise you've got nothing to go on really. So today it's a little bit of an esoteric set that I'm going for. If you've got any suggestions for starting words, leave a comment. I'm going to start with pure which is an anagram of Peru. And the other guesses that I'll be doing as my first guess for each word will also be anagrams of countries. So let's see how we get on with that. Um, we're not really making much progress with this one. I should have tried halt earlier, but maybe it's halo. Oh, is it hall? No, it can't be hall. The L can't be last. Half. Wow, so that wasted seven guesses. Let's hope that my other um, starting words are more helpful. I'm trying rain next, which is an anagram of Niger. Um, and we've got at least one letter, so that's a start. Let's see how close we can get with that. And the answer is not very. So the E could well be fifth. Let's try and get sated by guessing that. Okay, so we've got a bit of progress now. It could be a double E, it could be sheet, or steep. Um, I think it's at best a 50-50. Let's just try one and see what we get. And that was very lucky. Um, for my six letter guess, I'm starting with serial, anagram of course of Israel. And we've got the R in the right place, so that's helpful. The E is not second, so are we going to start with three consonants or are we going to have a vowel? Probably a vowel second. Let's try purged. Oh, so the E is in the right position, but it's not an ED or an E. Oh, it could be an ER ending. We could have a duplicated R. Let's try cornet first, though. Okay, we still could have a duplicated R, but at least we're making progress. Is the T going to be first or fourth? That's the question. And if it's not last, what is the last letter? I'm going to try vortex. Very unusual few letters in that, but it is correct. I'm very happy to get that. Um, and I'm going to try regalia for my first guess at the last one. Anagram of Algeria, of course. So that's the full set of uh, starting guesses. And we've got three of the letters. Interesting. I'm going to try an ED ending. Probably. <laughs> um, I just have to use the L and the A earlier in the word. Oh. I keep thinking of words that have got a G in or an R, so it can't be clanged, or charted. In fact, we would need to use the L anyway. Let's try blanket, actually. I think that could be correct, and it would at least tell us if the E is sixth, and it's not, so it's obviously not an ED ending either. And that's scuppered my line of thought, hasn't it? Because all four of those letters are in the wrong positions. Uh, or oh, it could be a UN start. It could be a double N. It could be unclean. Okay, so that was wrong, but at least we've got the start and we've ruled out lots of positions for the others. The A has to be there. The L. I don't know. It could be an L-E ending. Um, oh, unseals, perhaps? I've only got two guesses left. I don't think this is likely to be correct. Oh, is it unleash? As I was saying, I don't think it's likely to be correct, but it'll give me a lot of information on the E-A being there makes me think that this has to be correct. 
and I really hope I'm right because it's my 20th and final attempt. And I'm relieved to say that that was correct. So 7445, definitely not my finest attempt, but we didn't fail. That's the important thing. I got very unlucky with the uh, four letter one, guessing the last letter several times in a row. Um, really put me up against it, but I'm glad that I managed to succeed in the end. As I said, if you've got suggestions for themed starting words you want me to use, leave a comment and I'll give you a shout out when I use them on a future video. Otherwise, that's the Steptal Puzzle for today. Thank you for watching and bye for now.